Moneybags the Baby Boy, an eerie Pennsylvania artist, which is known across the world, which the R&B artist which been on MTV with the classic hit That Wet Box, was a huge hit we all had heard. Moneybags the Baby Boy is also known for being from a street called West 18th Little Italy in Erie. He graduated from Strong Vincent High School in 2011. Born in 1992, he was also a great basketball player. As his music started to grab more attention, he also ended up having his own shoe line hitch was called Young Shutter's Mulals. Also in Heel's shoe line, which is called Young Shutter's Ladies for the Women. Top of that, he also wrote two books which got published also sold on Amazon. Moneybags the Baby Boy is a wonderful I would like to say wonderful also one more time a wonderful artist. Lyrics is always a great joy and choice of words. He is a 30 years old hard worker. I wonder when he have time for fun with everything he already successful done. From in shoe line which is made from Italy. To written two short series books. I might have to add which is very interesting. From making a lot of music which means he also had to come up with a lot of words to even make that many verses. And young genius. Creative. Also have to add post manner person that love women. Great with women. Moneybags the baby boy also went by the name of Mike Mike. His childhood name also falls by his birth name. Michael Coles Jr. him and a lot of females loved being around each other. He also went by his middle name Darnell also ended up with the name of the nail you. He was good in sports and music. Always had wordplay can always make some money. He loves getting money. Reason why he went by money. Married to the money and a lot of women wants to say that too. He always said that, but a lot of women had a major crush on him. Some ladies thought they secret was told somewhere, but not all I made add. He also knew about being independent. Sometimes you have to go get it yourself. As long you got two feet and can walk, you have transportation to go get money. Everyone loves that about him. Everyone loves that about him. And full-time hustler with ambitious... Moneybags the baby boy is very charming. He also tell funny jokes, love to make people laugh and smile. He loves saying, you don't always got to give God his glory, give him his roses alive. I always love that about him. Very talented, popular, also very respected. Ladies love Moneybags, the baby boy. All race, not one side or race didn't love him being around. He not even dead, but he loved getting his roses alive. Which we all do as well. He very motivated. He can motivate anybody and anyone. Another talent I love that about him. And also love how he ain't scared to do anything he wants to do, but he is a short guy about 5 feet 7 and 125 pounds, that's it. Moneybags the baby boy is like a music god to me. When his music comes on, then it's on loud, a lot of laughs, smiling, and dances. He also is a people person. He can go and be anywhere in the world, end up around also having a lot of homies he calls them well friends. He never started nothing at all but had haters which can't bother him or fear him which makes haters just quit hating on him. Moneybags the baby boy were and still is very handsome you just can't stop women from jumping on him in a sexually way which would make people think knew it was going to happen till people say no these ladies all over him. Like everywhere he goes. Which would make even more females like that about him see if you good to women you get treated like you love women. Also very creative and talented. Well yes Moneybags the baby boy was also got to be the most hated as people also be hating on him be hate comes with promoting he a good guy. Popular, smart, funny, talented and a go-getter. He end up in a jungle he and there and coming out with money and a lot of women having crushes on him. As he never fell out of being focused when it's go time. He stay focused and be saying, keep grinding one day you become the kingpin. No matter what you grinding about you could become a kingpin still. You get what you put in. It's like working at a job if you work 5 hours then you get paid that 5 hours if that was good enough for you that all you going to make from it. But if you keep a job or keep working you get paid more and more until your retirement money would also be a good bonus. But I like to keep a kingpin mind state owning my own business being self-employed work my own hours. That's what money bags the baby boy for you.